You're watching Mysteries and Mayhem, Vampires of Spirit Valley Valentine's Day 2023. This original comic book story is set within the short story universe. Each of the Mysteries and Mayhem stories was written in an open-ending sort of way. It's for you the active listener to gather all the information presented in the story. At the end of the story, you must figure out the ending. In addition, the Mysteries and Mayhem stories are fantastic ways for viewers slash subscribers to learn character development, character arc, story structure, and lots more. Please click on CC closed captions. Afterward, listen, learn, and enjoy this epic Valentine's Day story with a serious twist. City of Spirit Valley slash History The supernatural plagues this city. Travelers, as the locals call them, come here from all around just to see spooky stuff. To keep travelers out of the city, the locals have fake fog duty. Yet, despite Spirit Valley's spooky elements, there are plenty of fun things to do here. The rising levels of supernatural activities are what brought me here. My family has a long history with the supernatural. It's because we're a family of vampires, said Valentine Waltiero in his high-tech device. Valentine's house party slash frozen bar. Valentine strolled over and he stood next to a lovely young lady named Hala Castle. I'll have a frozen Mary with a sprinkle of lemon crystal sugar, said Hala. Happy Valentine's Day, said Valentine. The same goes to you, said Hala. I hope you're enjoying all the masqueraders, live band, exotic dancing, and such, said Valentine. I'm happy you invited me, said Hala. Is that blood orange I smell, asked Valentine. It's my blood orange scented sunscreener, said Hala. SPF level, said Valentine. Level 300, said Hala with a cheeky grin. You've got something against the sun, said Valentine. My body is hypersensitive to sunlight, said Hala. Care for a private tour, said Valentine with a sexy smirk on his face. Sure thing, said Hala in a sexy voice as she nicely grabbed onto Valentine's arm. Valentine's house party slash gallery. These are fantastic, said Hala as she lovingly gazed over at two Madame Tussaud wax statues. These are statues of my father Gerald and my mother Ludwina. Such marvelous names, said Hala. Having these around, it's like they are still here with me, said Valentine. I smell cologne and perfume, said Hala as she sniffed the wax statues. I spray them myself, said Valentine. Wait. I could have sworn her left eye slightly opened, said Hala as she curiously gazed at the statue of Ludwina. The light reflecting off the water fountain display causes this, said Valentine. Brilliant, said Hala. Have you ever attended the Spirit Valley Carnival, asked Valentine? That's a random question, said Hala. With me, random questions come out of nowhere, said Valentine. Flashback slash Spirit Valley Carnival slash The Haunted Castle slash Gerald and Ludwina Gualtiero. We're up next, said Gerald. I'm excited, said Ludwina. I'm not going in there, said Valentine. Are we sure about this, asked Gerald. Everyone raves about this haunted castle, said Ludwina. Things can get weird and crazy, once inside, said Gerald. This entire city is weird and crazy, said Ludwina. Let's do this, said Gerald. They raced inside the haunted castle with the biggest smiles on their faces. It's a vampire, said Gerald as he jokingly pointed toward a young lady with pale skin. I beg your pardon, said Hala as she furiously walked away. He's kidding around, said Ludwina. Suddenly, all the lighting flickered. What the heck is going on whispered Gerald as Ludwina frighteningly grabbed onto his arm. What's taking you guys so long, asked Valentine as he opened the door and gazed all around the room. They're petrified, said Davy Price as he found his mother Linda Price motionless next to Gerald and Ludwina. Something bit you, whispered Davy as he noticed the bite wound on his mother's hand. Valentine noticed a large balloon across the room with a cryptic message that read. Michael Jackson was more than a thriller. He was amazing. Playing Thriller by Michael Jackson, said the music app on Valentine's high-tech device. As the song Thriller played, the petrified patrons woke up. All my cash in my wallet is missing, said Gerald. 
My credit cards are gone, said Ludwina. Someone stole my mood ring, said Linda. This is the work of a vampire, shouted Davy. That's what I think, said Valentine. You're just teenagers, thinking out loud, said Ludwina. This happened once before, said Linda as she quickly removed a small perfume bottle filled with holy water out of her purse. Next, Linda sprayed the holy water into the air. Suddenly, the eeriest sounds were heard rooftop of the haunted castle. Flash forward slash Valentine's house party slash gallery. Are you done randomly thinking? asked Hala in a cheeky voice. This full-length portrait is of my grandfather and grandmother, said Valentine. So, it's back down memory lane again, whispered Hala. Do the names Leaf and Astrid ring a bell? asked Valentine. I've never heard of them, said Hala. My grandparents were music performers on board the Queen's Conquest, said Valentine. Marvelous! Whispered Hala. Flashback slash Queen's Conquest cruise ship slash Leaf and Astrid Gualtiero. Your performance was marvelous, shouted Hala with the biggest smile on her face. Thank you, said Leaf. Oh my gosh, whispered Astrid as she grabbed onto Leaf's arm. What is it? asked Leaf. I can't breathe, whispered Astrid as she fell to the floor. Leaf gazed all around the deck at other passengers as they too fell to the floor. Linda along with other passengers rushed the deck. They're petrified, said Linda. There's a note on the serving platter written in lipstick, said Gerald. It reads. Where did you get those peepers? Where did you get those eyes, said Linda. It's the lyrics to the song Jeepers Creepers, shouted Gerald. So, what, said Linda. We must sing the lyrics to wake them up, said Gerald. He's just a teenager, said an old gentleman. Total nonsense, said a young lady. It's certainly worth a try, said Linda. On the count of three, said Gerald. The passengers sang the lyrics to Jeepers Creepers. Thus, the petrified passengers woke up. Where's my wallet, shouted Leaf. All my rings on my fingers are missing, shouted Astrid. My heart-shaped necklace is gone, shouted Linda's mother Wilma Price. Rapid breathing, confusion, and bike marks on hands, said Gerald as he curiously gazed all around the room. So, said Wilma. Someone is a vampire, said Gerald. You've read one too many comic books, said Hala. Are you wearing blood orange sun lotion, asked Linda. Yes, I am, said Hala with a wicked grin on her face. Flash forward slash Valentine's house party slash gallery. Some fancy Valentine's Day party this turned out to be, said Hala. I'm sorry, said Valentine. You've spent half the night recalling things from the past, said Hala. Please excuse me for a quick second, said Valentine as he responded to the alert text message on his high-tech wrist device. Take all the time you need, whispered Hala as she rolled her eyes. In the mirror, Hala fixed her hair, adored the mood ring on her finger, and lovingly gazed at the heart-shaped necklace around her neck. Suddenly, Hala screamed at the top of her lungs. What is it? asked Valentine as he rushed over toward Hala. The painting, said Hala with a frightened look on her face. What about it? asked Valentine. They were standing at the top of the stairs and now they're one step down, said Hala. You can't be serious, said Valentine. See for yourself, said Hala. Valentine curiously gazed at the painting of his grandparents. Things are moving about in this house as you go on and on with your random stories, said Hala. I'm not following you, said Valentine. I'm out of here, shouted Hala as she rushed down the hallway. Valentine's house party slash dungeon. What's going on? asked Hala as she curiously gazed all around at the petrified partygoers. I'm Detective Davy Price, said Davy. Haven't we met before? asked Hala. We met at the Spirit Valley Carnival, said Detective Davy. What have your detective skill detected? asked Hala. Loss of blood, fatigue, pale skin, bike marks on hands, etc., said Davy. A vampire got to them, said Hala. Check out this weird text message that I received, said Valentine. Now we have bad blood. Look what you've done, whispered Hala. These are lyrics to Taylor Swift's song called Bad Blood, said Hala. 
play Bad Blood by Taylor Swift, said Valentine into his high-tech wrist device. As the song played, the petrified partygoers woke up. Each of the partygoers had alert messages that currencies were transferred from their money accounts. That's an adorable mood ring and a lovely heart-shaped necklace you're wearing, said Davy. Thank you, said Halla. None of those items belongs to her, said Gerald. She's a vampire thief, said Lidwina. The mood ring belongs to me, said Linda. Funny. I had a heart-shaped necklace that was stolen from me on board the Queen's Conquest, said Wilma. Vampires travel in packs you know, said Halla as she snapped her finger. Thus, the party-goers rushed over and stood behind her. Aren't you afraid of vampires, asked Halla. We're vampires, also, said Davy. Happy Valentine's Day, said Valentine with the biggest smirk on his face. An all-out war erupted. Vampires vs Vampires Thanks for watching. As stated earlier, the mysteries and mayhem stories are open-ending. Here are a few more facts that could help you figure things out. Many of Valentine's partygoers, patrons at the Spirit Valley Carnival, and passengers on board the Queen's Conquest ended up inside the Spirit Valley's post-traumatic health facility. A lovely young lady applied for a job there. Your name is, asked the handsome young male staff member. My name is Mary Midnight, said Halla with a cheeky smirk on her face. Such an adorable mood ring and lovely heart-shaped necklace, said the male staff member. Thanks, said Mary Midnight. Again, you the active listener will decide the ending. Did you enjoy Mysteries and Mayhem, Vampires of Spirit Valley Valentine's Day 2023? Leave your fantastic comments in the comments section. Welcome goes to all who are new to the channel. If you enjoyed this video, please click the like button and simply share this video on your social media. If you wish to keep up to date with the epic comic book content on this channel, just click the bell notification icon. More mysteries and mayhem original comic book stories. Coming soon. Happy Valentine's Day 2023.